hey guys, my fellow Barbie here. Now today I just wanted to do another video on needs and evaluative words. Today I want to be talking about the evaluative word um, accepted or you know not accepted. So you know maybe the accusation that you don't accept me. Um, and again we know that we use these evaluative words which are really not that helpful. They immediately make people get really defensive. So I want to explain the feelings that someone might have which would prompt them to um, say that they don't feel accepted. And I think that word feeling is kind of um, what we forget to often use. Um, we might present it as an accusation, like you don't accept me, but really what we mean is I don't feel like you have accepted me. And acceptance is not necessarily a feeling, it's actually a need. So the feelings that would prompt someone um, to feel like that need is not fulfilled would be, you know, someone's upset, they're scared, um, and they might even be lonely. So again, this is very similar to abandoned, but I think abandoned is more of a strong word. And acceptance is something that we all want. Um, even those people who say, I don't want to be accepted by society, I don't want to be accepted, um, you know, they, they're really yearning for some form of acceptance. And I've had to learn to accept myself because I think that is a really important starting point. And with my family, I've also accepted that I am not going to get acceptance from them. And that's okay. If I don't want to be accepted by them, then they can't reject me. That choice is mine. I am empowering myself in that particular way. Um, so I think the underlying needs that go along with that is that someone has a need for inclusion. We all have a need for connection, um, and need for like community and a sense of belonging in some community, no matter what community that is, whether it be your family community, which is where I'm not going to be accepted. I have to expand my idea of community, which is where you guys come in, which I have, you know, found this really awesome community that does accept me, which has fulfilled that need that was really lacking um, with the people that I guess immediately surround me. And, you know, with that kind of acceptance in a community, we need to feel like we're contributing to that community. We need a level of respect, respect from our peers. Um, so I think on, on another note, um, I'll probably do a video on acceptance in that regard. But definitely, um, if you are not feeling accepted, then really what you are feeling is upset, um, maybe scared, maybe lonely. And I just want you guys to sort of think of that. Um, if, if someone doesn't, if you don't feel accepted, then you really need to look at maybe those underlying needs um, and see if you can find them somewhere else. Um, there's no point in being in a relationship um, begging someone to accept you who's just not going to accept you. You know, just because someone um, can't see your worth doesn't mean that you are worthless. There are other people out there who will accept you, um, who will be able to see your worth and value what you have to offer. Um, people who are maybe more open-minded. So I think that's something really important to remember. Thank you for watching my video. Um, my next one will be on this idea of betrayal, which is really important, a valuative word. So thanks, guys. Thumbs up. Let me know your thoughts in the comments and subscribe if you haven't. Thanks.